What's going on guys? My name is Mark Wagner and today I'm going to be showing you how you can make a ton of money and take full advantage of Valentine's Day. Let's get into it. Alright, so just to give you some scope on really how big this holiday is, 55.7% of Americans over 18 are married and every single one of those people is going to be expecting a gift on Valentine's Day and that's only married couples. Think about the dating couples that are also going to be buying gifts for each other. The majority of America is going to be buying relationship gifts in the next couple of weeks and you need to make sure that you take your piece of the pie. So throughout this video you're probably going to notice a pattern and that is me stressing the importance of conveying emotion. Valentine's Day is a holiday built on emotion and trust me when I say that being able to effectively convey emotion is going to be the difference between an okay marketer that may make a couple sales and an expert marketer that is going to crush Valentine's Day. I'm just going to go ahead and tell you that I'm going to be doing my Valentine's Day store with Instagram influencers and I'll probably just use Facebook to retarget which we'll get into shortly. But with Instagram influencers, I have a specific strategy. My ad copies are going to be designed around the page that I'm using. The great part about Valentine's Day is it's not just relationship pages that do well. In fact, all of those pages are going to be saturated. The best pages are going to be meme pages that really have nothing to do with relationships. Many meme pages are built around certain content so they have either more male followers or more female followers. My ad copy is going to be specifically designed for their followers. For example, if I'm promoting to men, I could say something like, imagine the look on your girlfriend's face as you give her this blah 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 blah. This is going to be huge because it's super personal and it conveys emotion really really well. In addition, although I normally use a bunch of hearts and stuff in the ad copy for a Valentine's Day product, I probably wouldn't if it was on a page mainly followed by men. Now let's talk about the ad. I almost always find that video ads work best, but sometimes that's hard for products, especially Valentine's Day ones, because it's a lot of jewelry and little trinkets that are kind of tough for videos. If you are going to sell jewelry or something similar, I recommend using a photo of a girl wearing it. That always seems to work better for me than just like a white background. Combining all of this with a Twitter style native ad is going to get you some great results. The next thing we're going to be talking about is retargeting. This is huge on Valentine's Day because I feel like a gift for your significant other is something that people kind of ponder on for a couple of days, or at least I do. You don't want to give someone a crappy gift, so it's usually not a quick decision. Make sure that you're retargeting all of your product viewers. Last year I didn't run much Valentine's Day stuff, but I remember that after I checked out Source, I got a retargeting ad showing someone giving the gift to their girlfriend. It was probably extremely staged, but I do remember thinking, wow, that is an awesome ad that conveys so much emotion, it'll cause people to go through with their purchase. This ad has stuck with me for a year. The last thing we're going to be talking about is how long that you have to do this. From the time that I'm posting this video, there's like a 10 day window, maybe two weeks where you can sell and people will still receive their products in time for Valentine's Day. You don't want to mess up any relationships, so be sure to be extra clear about shipping times when we're nearing the end of January. Keep in mind that I am referring to AliExpress products, but you can also find US warehouses on AliExpress and sell a little closer to Valentine's Day. Alright guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video and I really hope that you crush your Valentine's Day goals. Be sure to hit that big red subscribe button on your way out and I'll see you in the next one.